Hey, what's going on? Z-Man and Tech here, and I want to thank you for tuning into Snowly Games. As always, I appreciate you very much. And today I'm checking out Hover Steppers Zone 1 on Steam, courtesy of the developer. Much love and respect, and thanks for reaching out to uh, have me check out this game, showcase my, to my audience. Without much further ado, let's go ahead and check into what we have here. Okay, I'm gonna leave everything pretty much default here, um, and we're just gonna go ahead and jump in. So let's, uh, let's give it a try here. All right, use left stick to move board. Left shoulder to kick flip. Okay. Right shoulder to, or right trigger to boost. Okay. And yeah, we can do tricks with the face buttons. Left trigger to grind. Okay. Left trigger to swing around poles. Okay. Okay. Some objects are breakable. Oh, got it. Air special, okay. Let's see if we can find a big ramp for that. It, it does take some getting used to as far as like uh, the acceleration. Like I'm not used to holding up, I'm used to holding a face button for that. So I'm not sure if it's possible to change that. Um, All right, so we got some, uh, we got some ramps over here. Yeah, just kind of throwing it out there. Figured I'd mention that. Um, okay. Tutorial complete. Now try some challenges. Okay. Cool. Alright. I kind of want to just play around with the controls a little more, get used to this, okay, maneuvering's not too bad. But yeah, just gonna play this for, you know, roughly 10, 15 minutes, get an idea of what's going on. Maybe check out the other area as well. Maybe there's different challenges there or something, but we'll, we'll see what the challenges here are like. All right. So the trick system is a little like stiff I guess not like in the sense of it like being hard to control but I think in the animations it's a little stiff like say for instance um, let's see the kickflip looks great actually but let's say like see the transitions not bad it's just like it it seems like the animation like if you if you swap between I don't know. I'm pretty sure that'll be fixed in, in, in uh, once the full game releases, but that might just be how the animations look. If it was like a smoother rotation for the flipping and turn, uh, you know, like uh, turning, I think that'd be cool. I think I have a. Uh, existing score for these already is what it is yeah okay so just to kind of showcase what they've got uh, this one is you know collecting little objects here
afford the challenge. Oop. Oh, I still got it. I was worried about that. <laughs> Four seconds. Come on, man. Find another one. Alright. Probably didn't beat my last one. No, I did. I think I did. Hey. No, I got it. What did I get last time? Forget. Alright. Well, I've already done that one, so let's see what this one is. I don't think I've seen this one yet. Alright. Collect as many items as you can in 50 seconds. Oh, it's what they gave me for... It's like a silver, I guess. 30 seconds, best combo. Let's do it. I freaking missed. Oh. So I was thinking I could, I think you can fly off of that ramp and um, grab the pole in the air. So. Let's see what we got here. Um, yeah, highest combo in 30 seconds and then Highest combo in 45 seconds. I'm not too, I'm still not too privy on how to chain this stuff a little bit better than what I am. Hit the checkpoints in 60 seconds. This one I have done. Um, necessarily doing any tricks because I don't want to slow myself down but I'll try to throw some in there as I go I don't think it really matters oh, okay thankfully they give you an arrow to show you where they are I don't know why I did that. I just, I wanted to. <laughs> I definitely didn't beat my last one, I'll tell you that. It's probably just got some challenges, or maybe we can just kind of do like a little free run. Yeah, it's got some challenges. Oh, wow, okay. It's got a lower level, too. This is crazy. go on this. I would assume so. Is this a hoverboard? So how do we get back up? <laughs> so I'm going to try to go through these gates. But yeah, soundtrack is fire right now. I'm definitely on board with that. You know me and soundtracks. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, it's terrible. I am so trash at this.
that didn't actually take me where I wanted to go. I'm trying to get back to the very top. I gotta figure that out. Unless it's this right here. Nope. Looks like some sort of a fan that would do that, but I guess that's not what's happening right now. Check this out. Uh, yeah, the, <laughs> the not being able to stop properly thing is kind of annoying. All right, so score as many points as you can, 120 seconds. All right, another one of these. Take it. Yeah, having enough time actually is pretty cool. I gotta smash these things? Oh, you do. Oh, those are just bonuses. But I, it would have, it would have been nice to see that before. I, it was there. I just didn't see it. when not paying attention. Still got 50 seconds. I might be able to smash a few more of these. The bonus will help. <laughs> nice. Okay, so don't fall and smash seven. So we did that. I'm not sure how much these bonuses are gonna help, but. I got like a C. Yep. We'll take it. I tried messing with PSX controls, but it didn't really change anything. Maybe that's just enabling PlayStation controls. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Great soundtrack, though. Soundtrack is amazing. Um, but yeah. Not bad. Um, it's definitely interesting. Um, I'm interested to see where this goes. I like the, you know, the kind of uh sandbox aspects to it um kind of just mess around you know uh when you have these kind of games it that's what you like it, it's best experience when you can kind of explore and kind of just mess around do tricks you know so it's pretty cool i do like that aspect of it um but yeah i'm interested to see if there's any other control schemes um this one is it's not daunting or anything like that but it definitely does take some getting used to um I feel like it could almost be a little bit of a hindrance um but once you learn it it does feel good to kind of like have that flow going um so yeah i kind of it's, it's kind of like that well that's the best way i can put it right now but so far so good um i like what i experienced thus far and uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna leave it here and if you want to see more definitely uh let me know down in the comments i'll keep an eye on this game uh, for its full release and hopefully will be considered for a key if not uh, I may go ahead and just pick it up either way um, but 
I really would like to know if there's a different control scheme. So that's kind of where I'm at with it. If you like what you saw, definitely like, comment, subscribe. Remember to keep it locked to Snowly Games for all of your indie game, third party game, tech review coverage, and sometimes Nintendo and retro games thrown in the mix. All right. Have a good one. Take care. Futuristic classic. The futuristic classic. Time is of the essence. I feel like I have mastered. Futuristic classic. The futuristic classic. It's always moving forward, so I'm never moving backwards.